Sprung ist da. Ich denke an meinen Lauf. Okay, and welcome back. It's your boy. First. Oh. Yo. Coming back to you with another honest review. Okay, apologies for the long wait. I was battling with Wi-Fi, hence the lack of uploads. Apologies for that. But we are back on our daily upload schedule so don't forget to subscribe because i am doing all vehicles in gta online right now okay so in today's honest review we are going to be going over the benefactor slagen slagen not too sure how you pronounce it but yeah because it's actually on discount this week it's under legendary motor sports and let's see how much it is okay it's a decent discount it's coming in under 800,000 sludgeon yeah it was a part of the arena war update so that something wasn't too long ago but yeah so that's the car on the website and here's the car in front of us right now yes i just skipped the whole process of us just waiting for the car to come so first impressions it's i'm getting a lot of amg gt vibes i'm guessing that's where it was based off or the main idea comes from so let's just go oh okay really good tone let us go and see how it performs as standard Okay, so it feels like any other sports car. There's nothing that stands out, you know, to make it more unique. Okay, it's backfiring like mad, which I like, you know, nice touch. Okay, let's get a quick sound check. Yeah, no, it's a good sounding car. I'll give it that. Looks, uh, looks are uh, really good to the real life comparison of what it is. Handling is. Yeah, it's ne it's a it's never a review without a crash. But anywho, what do I say? Some vehicles are like uncontrollable this you can actually point in a direction and it will go that way i really like the back the back looks amazing but anyway let us now see what the actual interior looks like does the inside match the outside oh okay i like things here i like the stitching very large okay uh the old dash is very nice uh gauges you can see the old gauge when you duck down that's a good thing because when you're doing tests then you need to be able to see the old gauge but no this is a really good interior it's a decent interior so i'm happy about that so let's head back to the office now and see what type of modifications we can do to it. I really hope there's a lot of modifications that can be done to this vehicle. Hmm. I really thought I was gonna crash here for some reason. But yeah, will this car win your races? I doubt it because it's in the same class as the Pariah, the Ocular Pariah. So I think it's an oculus, but yeah, it's in the same class as that. It's not an armored vehicle. It will get blown up in one rocket. Uh, so yeah, 800,000 under a million. So it should have decent 
customizations hopefully i've spent more and gotten less so let's check it out okay so i'm at that point of the video where i'm gonna ask you to please like the video don't forget to subscribe if you are enjoying my content please subscribe don't forget share the video with your friends let's get this channel out there let's get my videos out there thanks guys okay so since we are back already let us just jump in and see what modifications we can do Okay, and that's the customization done. So, I went for a yellow accent color on the roll cage. So, first impressions of it now. This thing has a lot of customization. Like, no joke. You can make this your own. It's not a Benny's vehicle level of customization, but your this requires customization. I really like the look of it. I went for a race style. That's why maybe I was taking a little bit long with deliveries there towards the end. But yeah. So I just have to say this wing is massive. It's humongous. But yeah. Let's see what doors we can open and see what we can see. This vehicle. 
they can all open wow the engine is just one big cover that is but look how big that is. damn that, that that gotta be powerful okay stripped out really can't you just see more roll cage insider insider is looking absolutely insane now that is track inspired so let's just close the doors and we can head on out and see how this vehicle performs now I think I'm in love okay and it's actually not that great even after all the mods and things have just been applied it's not that amazing okay the fact that it hasn't sent me flying into a building is a good sign oh, that dirty dirty sound yes No, I'm re I'm enjoying my time with this car. I I don't think I'm gonna sell this one because I'm really I'm having fun right now. It's just such a good handling vehicle. Handling is actually not that great. Bro, what are you talking about, man? And I'm glad about that. Oh, okay. It just almost killed me right there, but it's fine. It's, it's nothing, you know. So I think I'm just gonna round with you, the review up here. Do you need to pick this vehicle up? You don't have to. It's not a must-own vehicle. It's fun. So I'm gonna give it a seven out of ten on. You have to pick this vehicle up. So yeah, that has been my review on the Sludge and GT, that's probably not how you say it, but yeah. So that's my review done, I guess I'll see you in the next one, peace.